So you might be trying to figure out how you can actually put a video inside of a photo on your TikTok video or whatever. Now, this is a pretty basic process, but it could mean a couple of few things. So for one, if you're talking about like filming yourself and then making a video after, and then like putting a photo and then filming it after, like it's a very basic process. What you want to do is you want to go ahead and make your way over to your you know specific TikTok video application here. You want to click the plus button. And all you want to do here is start recording. So what you can do is you can pretty much just start recording like this. And whenever you're ready, whenever you want to get, you know, get done recording, you can click stop. And let's say you want to add a photo right after this. Well, what you can do is you can go and click on the effects button, which is right here on the bottom left. And then you will come here. So you want to pretty much just allow access to all photos. And there should be a little button here that will allow you to post a photo. So I think this is the button that allows you to do it. So what you can do, and it pretty much is on by default. So as soon as you click that plus button, you will see now, if I were to go ahead and kind of put my hand here, you will see that the photo is actually kind of interacting with my specific camera. But what I can do is I can go ahead, so if I were to go like this, you can see that my hand is right there. You probably don't want your face in it if you want to add an actual photo. So what you want to do here is you want to make sure nothing is in front of the camera, not even your face. And you want to go and bring in a photo like this. So now all you have to do is go ahead and whenever you're ready, you can just start holding down on the photo like this and make sure your face is in there like my camera. And then whenever you're done, you can let go. Now, if you want to remove this filter after, what you can do is click here, click off of this filter like this, and you can go ahead and, you know, go back to what you were doing before. So you can go and start recording again. And that is all you're going to have to do. So now if we go and click the check mark here, you will see that the video now will pretty much be just the standard video that you made. It'll go to that photo that we showcased earlier. And then that is it. And then it'll go back to that video. So that is pretty much how it's done. A very basic process. Doesn't really take too much time. If you have any other thoughts or questions, I'll let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.